All right, today I'm gonna show you our homemade travel trailer. Now this trailer took us a year and 10 months to build and that was working on it on weekends and vacation time. And this trailer, we built it so it can go anywhere that I can drive my truck. Uh, it's an off-road travel trailer. It's registered as a travel trailer in the state of Texas. So here, I'll let you take a look at it. And we've got um, 33 inch BF Goodrich tires on it. And it's on a Timbrin um, axles or Timbrin axle suspension. It's the off-road suspension. So you can get maybe a better look at it here. The overall dimensions of the trailer is 17 foot. That is from the tongue to the back bumper. And then it is six and a half foot wide. We've got a, right here is our pull out outdoor kitchen, two burner outdoor kitchen with a sink got our propane here on the back 33 inch spare tire and air conditioning unit this is our electrical and water everything is in here underneath the bed of course our water fill cassette toilet uh, this is where you remove the cassette So that cassette pulls out so we don't have a black water tank on demand hot water heater fuel tank for the diesel heater that's what we have for heat tongue box so the trailer is made out of two by three square tubing here and then the tongue is a three inch uh, square tubing, quarter inch thick that runs from the front all the way to the rear of the trailer. So you can see that tongue running all the way back. We've got 200 watts of solar up on the roof. And now this trailer is built with an expandable roof. So inside right now is about five foot two inches. And then when we get into position, we raise the roof and there is six foot four inches of clearance maybe six five so i'll show you what the inside looks uh like collapsed with the roof collapsed and then i will raise the roof trailer is a little dirty we just got back from a trip so as you can see these panels here when the roof is raised this one here will stand up. This one here and one on the driver's side, they fold down into place. And then you've got the rear panel that will stand up. So I'll get the roof popped up and uh, then show you what we have on the inside. So to pop the roof up, got to unlatch the roof all right everything is unlatched so i've got a button here to press and 
the roof raises. So you can see in here. All right, so let's get the roof raised high enough. Gotta go a little bit higher. All right, all the sides are down. I've got to put the corners to seal up the corners and the roof will be on. Then we'll talk about the inside of the trailer. Right, so I've got those four aluminum corners that go on each corner with a gasket material in there to seal it up. And then you can notice this 550 cord wraps around and hold those corner pieces into place with a little pressure on the corners to make the gasket seal up. All right, so there is the trailer with the roof popped up and the sides are down. All right, here we are inside the trailer. It's got a queen size RV bed. We've got some cabinets back here at the back. This is the cable for all of the electrical um, that is in the roof. So we've got LED lights. We've got two um, fans, one fan above the bed. The bed one fan above the shower and yes this has a wet bath so we've got our shower and our toilet we've got the shower curtain here that hangs up on these clips to close this area off We've got granite countertops, microwave. We also have an induction uh, single burner. Our power ports pop up for electricity or 12 volt, 110 or 12 volt. And we've got a two person dinette that will drop down into a bed so you can sleep three in here to be a little tight uh, but you can sleep three this is the control for the on-demand hot water heater which not that happy with the hot water heater the, the water does not get as hot as it should 
it only gets about 100 to 102 degrees uh, and it should get a lot hotter than that here's the control for our diesel heater which the vents for the diesel heater are here the actual diesel heater is underneath that seat uh, with the two vents All right, so I hope you um, enjoyed the tour of this trailer. It's not very big, but that was the reason that we built it. Uh, I looked at a lot of trailers on the market and there was nothing available to do what I wanted to do. I wanted more than a bed in a box. I wanted to be able to stand up. I've slept in a tent uh, and I have slept without a tent a lot. And when I go places now, I wanna be have a little more comfort if I can. And so that's the purpose of this trailer. If my truck can get there, this trailer can get there and we can stay comfortably. Uh, a generator will power the air conditioner and the microwave. Uh, the solar setup that we have should power our induction burner. We've got um, two gel cell batteries, 100 amp hour batteries, and then 200 watts of solar on the roof. And I'll probably expand that solar system a little bit, maybe next year. Um, but back to the reason we built it is all of the trailers out there that were close to this were going to cost you around $60,000. And that's just way too much money to spend on this type of trailer. So we built this trailer for less than $25,000. Uh, all in budget is less than $25,000. So, if you have any questions on what we did, uh, feel free to leave them in the comments below. If um, you need some more information, you can also email me. My email is listed on our website, so you can um, find contact information there as well. Uh, you'll be seeing this trailer a lot more um, throughout the year. We'll be taking trips, also be using it to stay in when we um, travel some for training as well. So if you like this video, be sure and give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel uh, to help our channel grow. Thanks for watching.